Hey guys, it's Lucy and welcome to day 10 of my 12 days of running the house. early on a Sunday morning to rummage through the hat and pull the miles out just in case I got the nine miler and uh, I got up nice and early and I pulled out the one miles now I was always a little bit worried about pulling the one miler out and I was always hoping maybe that could be like the last one I do but no it's decided to turn up today well the reason I was a bit worried about the one miler is because I wasn't really sure how to film the whole video with only running one mile but you know what we will make it work uh, it's very cold, I've got up nice and early. Not many people around, so yeah, let's get this one mile done for day 10. And the subject that I'll be talking about today is, I've really got a lot of things to say on it, so it's good that I've saved it to the one miler. <laughs> and the benefit that I've had from running that I'll be talking about today is the feeling of freedom that it gives me. Right, let's get this one going. As you can see, it's still very, very cold. And again, no gloves. <laughs> Let's go. I get a sense of freedom from running that I don't get from anything else. I've not experienced this sense of just being out and being free or while doing anything else in my life. After I had my daughter, I used to be a stay-at-home mum and obviously I am a military wife. So my life revolves around those two people entirely. Like every category of my life revolved around them and Although I'm extremely grateful to have them in my life, I wouldn't change a thing. It can also make you feel a little bit trapped. Like you're at the back and call of someone else all the time. And I would also be physically in the house all the time. I don't get to choose where I live. I live where my husband is posted. Which means I get no help whatsoever because I don't know anyone at all. Basically, what would happen is he would be away and I would just literally be in the house with my daughter and wouldn't go anywhere for me, wouldn't do anything for me. Even when he is around, he's a busy guy. I can't expect him to be there for me. And when I was constantly physically trapped in the house, obviously I was able to leave, but there wasn't really a lot of reasons for me to leave for me. And that's the difference. That's what makes you feel trapped. But now I've trained my body to the point where I can run brilliant distances. I can do really good sessions and it's all solely for me. And that is a sense of freedom. But obviously I don't always get out as often as I am now because when my husband's away, it is hard, but I never quit, never use it as an excuse because it is my freedom. I guess you could say I used to go through a bit of cabin fever feeling trapped. I've turned down a road that I've never ran down before so I don't really know like where I'm going now because there was just so many people and I don't like filming in front of people. It's fine. I could get lost on my one miler. That's not crazy. Okay I think this is a dead end and I'm gonna have to go back on myself which is okay because I've only got a quarter of a mile left. Let's just keep going and see what happens. It wasn't a dead end. I think I'm just doing a loop. So that's good. Although these paths are quite icy. The quicker I can get off this, the better. Right, let's finish this mile off. We got this.
and that is one mile checked off just like that we've only got two more left now guys can you believe it i can't believe it it feels like it's gone on forever it's been consistent having to upload every other day but you know what i've done it and yeah um it's made running one mile feel even less than it did before i started <laughs> getting extra miles <laughs> this felt like nothing which is mad because back in the day my dream was to run a solid mile and now it feels like nothing so it's a lovely reminder of how far i've come on a freezing cold sunday morning i cannot like my fingers are freezing i should have brought gloves on this one tell me off in the comments <laughs> i deserve it but guys let me know in the comments below what makes you feel the most free is it running as well like me maybe it could be getting on your bike or whatever it is where do you find freedom and what makes you feel free i'm worried that i haven't filmed enough footage because well again i only ran them out <laughs> i always knew this one might be the shortest video of all of them let's be honest it's going to be a lot shorter than the 12 miles i reckon <laughs> but guys thank you so much for watching if you did enjoy the video make sure to give it a thumbs up hit the subscribe button if you want to see some more i'll see you on wednesday for the penultimate of 12 days of rummus thank you so much for watching and i will see you soon bye guys